Okay, so there's not an easy way to record the desktop of a Raspberry Pi directly. You're generally supposed to do it over a VNC connection, but I'm booting this up for the very first time and don't have the network configured yet. And so I just wanted my students to see what should happen. So I'm recording this with my camera in my basement with the lights off. And so basically, I just plugged in the, the phone charger. You see a bunch of text scrolling by and you get to this screen. So this is the Raspberry Pi desktop for Jesse. Um, Jesse's the first version of the Raspbian OS that boots by default into the desktop. And now I need to configure the, ultimately we want to get to a point where I can just plug in my Raspberry Pi without a monitor, without a keyboard, have it connect to my Wi-Fi network and be able to log in remotely, either using VNC or SSH and have everything just work. And so this is the boot up process. And so two things need to happen. One is I need to go over here and pick my Wi-Fi connection and then type in my top secret key, which it is hopefully not going to show you, but it is. Um, I assume I'll have some way to block that out before I post this. I mean, one, you'd have to know where I live and two, you'd have to be within broadcast range of my house, all of which would be exceptionally creepy and I would call the police. Um, but that acts like it's what well, it's trying to connect. And it acts like it did. Now you can go on and do things with, you know, just kind of typical um, gooey stuff. But I think to really learn to use Raspberry Pi well, um, so I just want to verify that I have some kind of internet connection. Sorry, my keyboard is kind of precariously on my lap, and so I'm not typing well. But the best way to know that, actually, so if I can get to Google News, then I'm working. Um, but ultimately, I think you need to learn how to use the prompt and I try to make that big enough for you to read what I'm typing. And so, for example, if I want to check an internet connection, I can do two things. Ping Google. And if it can get out and get to Google, and it keeps pinging and it has reasonable return times, I'm good. So I hit Control C to end that. I can also say IF config internet. I don't even know. I should know what IF stands for and I don't remember anymore. But the fact that on my WLAN 0, which is my Wi-Fi adapter, I've got a legitimate internet address tells me that I am, in fact, connected. So at this point, I'm basically up and running. And the next thing I would need to do would be to install VNC server and configure my, de my Raspberry Pi to automatically start the VNC server at uh, login. And that will be the subject of my next video.